All right, so this is it. The 17 inch front rim. Nice and just sexy and she's sturdy. No loose whatsoever. Hopefully she will stay that way. So that's the uh, whole situation. Man, she looks clean now, that's for sure. You know, I gotta clean her out. I gotta clean this guy out. You know what I mean? Clean this guy out. Let's see. Yeah, she couldn't use a little cleaning. We clean her out. But uh, yeah, put a little grease, put the shaft in, and uh, man, she's sturdy. She ain't moving. Love it. Beautiful. All right. So, definitely small on the front, but uh, slick look. Very slick. I like it. You uh, should guys comment down below if you like the new wheel. 17 in the front, 17 in the back. So, it's looking uh, sweet. All right, comment down below. Let me see what's up. What do you think? Okay, so let me see. Two hours later, we got everything done. What do we do? We took the uh, the strip nuts or screws from. Uh, let me see. Look at those. All right, these guys are nice, brand new. Took the uh, wheel out. Wheel out. <laughs> And I think the problem was these suckers. They wobbly inside. So we will give this rim to Tony. We have uh, spokes. We are going to have a rim. We're going to have a tire. This is 80, 100 by 19 uh, rim. Like I said, spokes. Uh, some of them are rusty, but it's all right. And let's put this guy on the side. We don't need it here. And, uh, yeah, she's looking different, that's for sure. But uh, she she's whippy. I, I, I sat on it, and she actually felt good, which is which is awesome. Put some air, which was enough, but I put some more here. I got, I believe, 28. Uh, put the uh, flat out for the front. So, unfortunately, uh, I couldn't get these guys out. Let's see. She goes right through. Yeah. So, I got one. I'll come up with a nut later. But, uh, other than that, the room, the room, the rim looks very nice. All right. It is... 3.0 17 so it's 3 inch by 17 rim I like it I hope it's very slim <sighs> looks very different very appealing kind of like those slick ties which are on interesting but uh, I don't know guys comment down below what you think was this a good idea I mean I really I could have ordered 19 inch but as you can see, I have a nice big room in between possibly a uh, controller, possibly a controller here, or controller from here to here and then the tail light. So I'll probably put something here one of these days. I don't know. We'll see. But right now I'm rocking this frame <coughs> and the other one is sitting and waiting for a different project hopefully soon enough again make sure that the space from the wire to the uh the brake screws is far enough um she mm, she looks nice and straight i like it very nice and straight. Yeah, big squeeze. All right. All right, comment down below. Tell me what you like. Okay, so I'm done. 
as you saw the video, we did good. We did a couple of very important things. Um, FYI, obviously, we got the wheel from uh, AliExpress. It took uh, about four weeks. Okay, this this tomorrow will be four weeks. So, not bad, you know. I've waited for my battery three months and never got it. So anyhow, what do we do today? As you can see the uh, videos uh, they just watched, we took out the rear wheel, we uh, removed the uh, hex screws from the uh, brake disc, uh, we cut them out, and uh, we replaced, replaced them with uh, titanium Titanium screws. I don't have them with me. I already put them away. But you cannot, apparently, you cannot strip them. So, took them down to the specs. And uh, next thing, what we did, we adjusted the brakes in the back. We straightened out the wheel in the back because it was a little bit to the left too much. Kind of, you know, work on that. Uh, see, I asked uh, Tony if he can uh, fabricate some shims for me because he's got plenty of wood. So if he does, he does. If he doesn't have a time, you know, whatever he does, it there will be something cool to have in the house to help you out. So uh, make sure that you keep your wheel straight while you tighten, you know, both bolts, because um, obviously you would have to do it at the same time, and that's almost physically impossible. <clears throat> then uh, we put a little bit more air in the rear. We install. The rim, so the rim came with a rim with the tire and a tube, and uh, tightened the spokes a little bit, threw the wheel out, and uh, what else do we do? Uh, yeah, we we couldn't get the uh, Allen keys, or Allen Allen uh, screws uh, from the forks. So as you saw in the video, we had to drill them out. So that was one on the left, one on the right. So we have only one and one on each side. We'll come up with idea to get something, uh, you know, close to. I know Tony's got lots of those screws. So when summer comes in, we'll address that once the season, you know, uh, comes alive. Um, other than that, we went from 19 from the front to 17 to the front. It It's nice. Uh, you know, it's not 12, it's not 16, like I see on the last of Saran's guys. Um, it is 17, kind of motorcycle rim, easy to get. So, we'll see. Um, I, uh, I'm i hoping not to replace this for next season and a couple more seasons to come. Um, I think small diameter rim uh, is going to be more stable uh, because I really don't see anything breaking in there i didn't see any bearings that were exposed i just saw in the other wheel the 19 inch they had side cups and that's it these have a different method um smaller cups obviously smaller wheel so hopefully that's not going to be an issue it is very stiff very steady it's not wobbly it's not moving so it's beautiful um i the rim looks brand new, so I'm extremely happy with it. Right now, it is 11 o'clock. I'm exhausted. I've been on it since 6 o'clock. So, about four and a half hours of work. But we have everything, everything done and tightened up. Uh, what do we have left? One more thing that we have left is the uh, rear brake light. And uh, we are completely done with the bike and we're ready for the season. Well, okay, rear brake light connection, uh, obviously, uh, feed the hydraulic line to the uh, 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 lever. So that's that project. And, uh, and what? Um, uh, cut the frame, which is really nothing. You know, five minutes is done. So we are going to kind of extend all the wires and connect the wires to the tail light so when we squeeze the lever the tail light goes off and i think we almost got a perfection for now all we're missing right now and all we want right now is the uh the battery the beautiful battery but uh other than that i think i'm uh 99.9 percent .9 ready for the summer for the season 
Today it is January 26th, and in a few days, next Wednesday is going to be February, and then March. You know what I mean? And uh, they saying in March is going to be weather like today, 45, 55, so... We're good to go. Anyway, so sorry the video is so long, but I had to look at my fingers. Ooh, grease. They cracked. Look at that. Yeah. That's all from the screwdrivers. Anyway, comment down below. Tell me if you like the wheel. Tell me if the bike is looking uh, slimmer, uh, nicer, you know, better look, whatever you guys think. Uh, share the video. Uh, show it to your friends that things could be done. I gotta wash my hands. Um, and uh, definitely like, and if you're not subscribed, make sure you subscribe because we probably going to have a lot of more to show in this channel. All right. So for now, the uh, tech channel is out and I am going to shave for tomorrow work and go to sleep. Guys, take care. All right. Safe if you are.